What's up guys? Welcome back to the Montilver. So here we're going to talk about the upcoming WWE Women's Money in the Bank match coming up this Saturday live at the O2 Arena in London. Okay, so we got Trish Stratus, the GOAT. We got Zoe Stark. We got Becky Lynch. We got Zelina Vega. Uh, EO Sky. And Bailey. All right, and I'm very excited about this match because it's star-studded. You got Trish in there, you got Becky in there. We've already done went down the list. And this is probably going to be, arguably, in my mind, the best women's Money in the Bank match. Because there's a lot of things going on here. There's a lot of variables, so let's break it down. Becky Lynch versus Trish Stratus, and then, sorry Trish, and uh, Zoe Stark. Those three are going to be focusing in on each other. They are locked in a rivalry right now that many people are enjoying, including myself. I said at the beginning, the only problem that I have with this rivalry is that Trish better not do a one-and-done scenario. She better not come back and lose one match, and she didn't. She actually won the first match, and now she's here to stay for the long run. And as we already know, she's a uh, regular on Raw now. That being said, you got Io Sky and Bailey, and that storyline is starting to evolve because Bailey and Io have been having issues. Ever since Backlash, Io and Bailey have had problems because when Io was facing off against Bianca Belair and Bailey got involved, Io Sky kind of feels like Bailey is responsible for her downfall in that match. Now, this Money in the Bank ladder match is going to be a big tell whether Damage Control is going to stay together or not. Obviously, they're not going to. They're going to split off. Question is how? Will it be here? Are they going to... Is, are they going to have EO win? And then, you know, Bailey will become jealous. And then they'll fight off for a couple of matches. And then EO will go on to do her own thing and then cash in uh, on either Rhea Ripley or Asuka. Or are they going to have um, EO cash in that night? You just, you just, you just like don't know what's going to happen with that storyline. Is Bailey going to cost EO? You know what I mean. So it's like it's a big, it's a big question mark there. Then you got Zelina Vega, who doesn't really have any rivalry per se in this match. She's kind of going in there alone with no relation to anyone. And I would like for Zelina Vega to win. In fact, I want Zelina Vega to win because Becky doesn't need it. We know Trish doesn't need it. Zoe's not ready for it. Uh, Bailey doesn't need it either. She's already won. Io could be interesting, and I'm open to that. But I want Zelina Vega to Zelina Vega to win, and here's why. Zelina Vega, in my eyes, proved at Backlash in Puerto Rico in front of her home people, her home country. The whole nine in front of in a, on a big stage that she could be an enormous star for this women's division she has potential okay and i've been a, a great advocate for her in the past i would like her to win to spark up that rivalry with rhea ripley and i know it becomes a little bit complicated because you know zelina vega's over here with lw on smackdown and Ray Ripley's on Raw, and then get kind of messy again. I get it. And I'd be even fine with Zelina cashing in on Asuka. I just want Zelina to be, you know, some, you know, a big part of the women's division. And it's money in the bank. You can cash it in in the next 365 days from when you win it. You got a whole year. So she can have an extra year to build her character to get more people invested in her. So by the time she cashes it in, we're money. So, yes, because in my eyes, Zelina and Io, they're in the same boat. There's, there's a good amount of people that like them and want them to win this match. But at the same time, there are doubts on both of them because we don't know how good Io is on the main roster without Bailey, And we don't know how much Zelina Vega is going to be able to connect with all the fans. And I mean all the fans as a champion. We don't know yet because we haven't experienced it. 
She had a decent run with Carmella with the Tag Team Championships, but this is a whole different field. This is a whole different story. This is a whole other level. So there's a lot to consider here. But it has to be Io Sky or Zelina Vega. You pick anybody else, I'm going to be just, why? Becky doesn't need it. I know the WWE has a tendency of giving, you know, the big star, that last athlete that they never have, with the exception of Sheamus. Sheamus could have taken the Intercontinental Championship from Gunther any time, but creative decided, no, we'd rather give Gunther this run. That is very rare. Very rare. We've seen a bunch of dreams squashed. Kofi Kingston comes to mind. He won the championship at WrestleMania. He loses it in a 10-second match with Brock Lesnar about eight months or so later. So that's like, we've seen it happen. But Io Sky and Zelina Vega have to win, in my mind, because we're trying to build the future, right? WWE's trying to build the future of the women's division. And Zelina Vega and, and Io Sky are gonna be around longer than the rest of the field. And they're in a position where they would bring something new, something fresh. We've seen what Becky Lynch can do. We've seen what Trish Stratus can do. We've seen what ba Bailey can do. Zoe Stark barely got on the roster, so it wouldn't be fair for her to win just yet. So it's got to be one of these two. I'd rather Zelina Vega, because she's a personal favorite of mine, and I feel like if given the chance, she can be a good champion. They're trying to build her as the, as the female Rey Mysterio, and I'm all for that. I'm hoping... Praying that she's going to win, but if you're rooting for Eosky, you think Eosky should win, I'm not opposed to that at all. Not opposed to it one bit. We know how good Eos in the ring, and Eo can catch it on Bianca and reignite that whole thing if Bianca takes that title back. We shall see. So let me know in the comments what you guys think is going to happen. Big week for wrestling fans. Big week for WWE fans. So... Let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Deuces.